Morning friends, standing here in front of Jerusalem University College Institute for Holy Land Studies here in Jerusalem, Israel. I was going to do a Facebook Live, but it just wasn't connecting. So now you get to be in glowing panorama. There's uh, the dumpsters. And uh, here's a beautiful view across the German colony, looking across the Sultan's Pool in the head of the Him Himnon Valley on the western side of the old city of Jerusalem. I can't turn the camera around with a push of a button on this camera, which is crazy. But up above here, it's a Greek Orthodox school. <coughs> Excuse me. Why am I doing this first thing in the morning? Well, because I have nothing else to do now. It's because we're heading off to our last physical settings field trip of four days up to the Galilee, which is going to be pretty special. Oh, there's a stray cat. Uh, Christine and I were in the Galilee four years ago on the tour we did. Oh, here come some of my classmates. And uh, it was a really neat place, very peaceful, very quiet, generally speaking. And uh, yeah, just a beautiful spot. So we'll be going to a few places that she and I went. So memory lane, it is what it is. Again, King David Hotel there in the center of your screen. And uh, here, we'll swing around. And there, uh, the southwest corner of the old city. The sidewalk going up there towards Zion Gate on the south side. And then looking now towards David's Citadel. And this is the neighborhood I live in. It's pretty amazing. We're uh, coming up toward our last, I think we're in our last three weeks of school here. Got two, two large papers to finish writing. Maybe even start a little bit. And uh, as soon as we get back from this trip, we'll be having a test on the Galilee. And um, yeah, and then a all-encompassing, cumulative, comprehensive one exam for the archaeology class where the Dr. Barkai has been teaching for the last 40 something years, 49 years, I believe. I better get that right. That might be on the test. And you have to spell everything correctly. Stuff like that. So again, the old city wall. Yeah, I talk about that all the time because we always seem to be doing these videos here. We'll have to do a uh, walking video through the old city. Wouldn't that be nice? Um, shuffled the the boy off to our friends, Uncle Mike and Aunt Becky, this morning. Left the house at 6, at 52 degrees Fahrenheit. And, uh, are they catching up to me? No. Nope. Got up there about 10, 15 minutes later. I think the electric bike is dying. Probably should have saved the money I spent on a used bike and put it towards a new bike with a warranty. A brand new battery, a brand new motor. This one's about three or four years old. Had a crack in the frame where it folds. It's a folding electric bike. So $150 later, got that welded. <laughs> yeah. So buyer beware, right? Oh well, again, that's life. So here, look, have you, whoops, sorry. Great view of David's Citadel, the tower, and then beyond. And they have a multimedia presentation in there uh, where they have 15, 20 projectors that project visuals on the inside of the wall and you sit in a certain site and get this uh, graphical history of, of Israel. Watch out for the guy on the motorcycle. So across here now, and uh, Christine and I were going to go see it when we were here four years ago after the group left. We stayed here for a week by ourselves, which was amazing. 
met Uncle Mike and Aunt Becky who have been instrumental in helping us do this thing here in Israel. There's the city wall. And uh, we went to see the multimedia presentation and it wasn't playing that night. And of course we waited till the last night we were here to go see it. Oh well, anyway, I'll uh, attempt to do some updates from the Galilee. There never seems to be time on our trips. We're uh, moving pretty fast and seeing a lot of sights, but I'll be putting pictures up at least. So anyway, that's it from the city of peace. Some consider the center of the universe, the meeting point of Africa, Asia, and Europe, and full of different peoples. So, Shalom.